Hello again. This is the second video about why are uh, Freemasons famous. And uh, I want to uh, point out again that it's obvious from this symbol how it relates to the squared circle because you have this um, you have this square measurement uh, in this square and compass symbol you have the square itself and, th and then you use you use the the compass to draw a cir circle as you can see on the image to the, to the right so you use these tools to create a squared circle which is this impossibility just like um, the philosopher's stone is seen as something impossible something that cannot be reached um, okay but what happened is that the I would say that the collective unconscious reacted to the video that I uh, that I did about this because uh, maybe two three hours after I did this video, um, a pretty big YouTuber released a video about the same subject and she kind of picked um, uh, continued where where I, um, where I where I where I ended off kind of you say um, because she she realized something about this this um, something that I missed about Freemasons and uh, I'm not so actually she didn't really in my opinion her unconscious is talking here in this video a bit you know her conscious is talking but also her unconscious is talking and her unconscious is planning and releasing this video perfectly um, and I will link to her um, oh I can see I, I didn't have her name here but I will leave a link to her in the video description I will play a few seconds because she actually found something that I missed and she did it just so that almost like some kind of reminder and, and, and I, I feel that okay uh, again the, the oneness of everything I feel it like this synchronicity that she do it she's doing it directly after mine and she probably didn't see my video because I'm not a big YouTuber, you know, uh, so I don't think she saw my video. She just happened to release hers at the same time, like this perfect, um, how do you say, um, intelligent design of reality or some kind of crystal, you know, <laughs> all reality is a big crystal, so there are yeah but let's just go to the to the point of what i wanted to say and um i will show to you what she said and then you will realize what it is okay and i will show a bit more blah 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 Let, let's look at it freemason refers to freestone masons the highest trained craftsmen, including sculptors and architects, who worked with the most precious material, freestone. So what she said was that it all started with freestone masons and freestone, you see, I knew directly that she kind of released this for me. That's what it feels like. It feels like she is um, she is um, 
her unconscious is giving a feedback to what I said. It feels like that to me. And um, so she mentioned freestone, and and so I just know directly that this is something big about the freestone, freestone mason. And again, you will see that freestone is actually a kind of limestone, and. Google will say that it is both a sandstone and a limestone, but actually when you look deeper into it, you will see that it's, it's actually more specifically um, olitic stones, which are a type of limestone. And this is a stone that I have been talking about actually because, uh, yeah. Um, because I'm talking about these stones and, and the olitic stone is, is this um, egg stone and you see this is something that I have in front of me actually on my table I have a little egg stone here that I picked up on the beach I have talked about it before and uh, uh, yeah so this is also has to do with this again this alchemical egg which they say is the is the um, is the philosopher's stone also you know so it, it it's a bit uh, yeah this is just great that what is called an egg stone like the Greek the Greek word for this stone, uh, olit, uh, the origin of the stone is Greek and it means egg stone and you know, um, yeah, I just, it's just so perfect. Um, and again it relates to this alchemical egg, you know, that I've been talking about a lot. And uh, yeah. So we end up here again, we ended up in, in limestone, because olit is, is, is a limestone, you can see it uh, in this little olit, olit article, you can see uh, composition mo most commonly composed of calcium carbonate, calcite or aragonite, you see, because the eggstone, the eggstone or olit, it's actually it is the same way that pearls are made, but it's made um, in the stone itself. And it can be, um, yeah. So, yeah. Quite simple stuff, see? And, uh, so again, freestone is more specifically a limestone because olitic, the egg stone, is, is a limestone. So again, the, the freemason comes from the word free, free, freestone mason and what is a freestone? A freestone is limestone or the egg stone of alchemy. So, yeah, it's just perfect. Just perfect, guys. Uh, so, see you another time. I hope you liked this video. Um, yeah, bye bye.